compensation, but they cannot be excluded from provision of reservation because they are discriminated on the basis of caste and not on the basis of economic status. So I am in favor of withdrawing economic facilities for of those economically uh, good uh, and strong scheduled caste people, but not the reservation because they also continue to suffer discrimination. And so reservation is a legal safeguard against discrimination and that has to be provided for a rich or a poor belonging to Sri Lanka's community. You see, have we not uh, reached a stage after 50 years? We have, uh, the study do not show, sir. Sir, the study, study do not show. Just a moment. Please go where, where we should also examine the economic and geographical uh, uh, background of person in order to ensure that benefit should uh, benefit should go to the person who deserve it most rather than to concentrate it in the hands of persons who do not need the benefit anymore. So that's fine. That, that's a very technical issue. If the, relate, if the relatively better off scheduled class person do not suffer from discrimination, theoretically speaking, then there is no need for reservation. But that is not the case. If, if that is the case, the, the Roman Catholic in Northern Ireland and the African American in USA who are economically better off would not have suffered from discrimination. Economic development by itself does not remove discrimination. So what we require is that you take away the economic benefit. You do not give the benefit whatsoever to the several cultures who are economically better off. But if they continue to suffer from discrimination, you have to provide some legal protection to them to get a new share. Now, if you discover that there are scheduled cars who are economically better off and do not suffer from discrimination, I am uh, with can you. you I am with you. Can you please call out what type of discrimination you are is speaking of? One is and a son of an IS officer is getting education in class uh, in first class first school of the country. What discrimination you are talking of then? And yet, what and yet, what this that disadvantage he, that gentleman that young boy has suffered? Because he has taken the education in the best of the classes and you are why giving protection to him, you are depriving another yet another scheduled caste person of a rural background because he, his right is usurped by taking a, giving protection to this man. That is exactly the question posed by other Kulshrist. Yeah, yeah. So Kulshrist has posed a theoretical issue. I am answering in a theoretical language. <coughs> if and scheduled caste, IS officer son, that's very Do not face discrimination. There is no case for providing him reservation. But if he does, then you have to provide a protection to him. This what, is what this kind of discrimination he has discrimination, the discrimination, 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 discrimination right from See, sir, sir, listen to me. Go to the SCST Commission. Go to the SCST Commission and look at the number of cases lodged by the SCST government employees of discrimination in their office and including judges for your information. Discrimination to not have an access to restaurant, discrimination to not have an access to temple is a category of discrimination. Discrimination in employment, discrimination in working condition, discrimination in promotion, discrimination in various areas. What kind of protection? You have to provide some protection to them. You cannot say that I you discrimination to continue. I Yes, I, that, that, that was my yes. answer. Yes. Uh, kindly, uh, there is another speaker. No, no. Uh, may, yeah. may, yes, may, yes, yes, just a minute. Yes. Uh, I, think, I think in the judgment in the Israel case, yes. this issue was addressed by a creamy layer concept. Yes. And conceptually, that addresses this issue. Uh, I mean, those who have crossed a particular threshold, they are no longer subject to discrimination, they do not need reservation, the familiar has to be identified and probably kept out of the benefits. That is for OBC, sir, that is not for Shetrukas. I think uh, no. it is no longer that is when the stage comes, that is in the second Only time. when the stage comes, that, is at the, at that, no. that conceptually that is answered. That's fine. That is, that is, that is, that is, that is in Indra Gandhi too, and in respect of OBC. Uh, yes, yes. I said <laughs> conceptual answer. What yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. I, I said conceptually, conceptually I am answering that if we prove, or if we have an evidence, statistical evidence, so we just, as I finish quickly, if, if there is a statistical evidence, the relatively better of scheduled cars do not suffer from discrimination, I am for withdrawal of that discrimination, but it has to be proved. Yes, Mr. Yes, Mr. Yes, Any question? Yes, I would just like to give three or four information inputs on the subject. One the judgment not only limited to the back of but specifically said creamy layer shall not apply to Shabdukha's judgment for the very reasons that under Chivalry is provided. Number one. Number two, there was 
a way of helping those who are not able to get reservation. That is, set up residential schools of high quality. They are working very well in Andhra Pradesh. They are working very well in Karnataka. I, I got it in the central government. But the previous government knocked away that money without using it and transferred it to some other department. And the present government is continuing the same policy. So when we try to bring people from below, that is obstructed. Then thirdly, in the, in the, in the, what, 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 that was what, not an exact what, question asked by mm, Justice Gulshetra and Justice no, I, so I am telling the positive way in which people know that they are not getting reservation. In peer group where there is discrimination, how do you meet that situation? I believe this is no, the, the first question. Yes. Same peer group discrimination yes. is not a justification for continuing by all of us the reservation against all of them. So we should not make an excuse, yes, that is wrong. But that is wrong, that wrong is great because we have created an atmosphere in which caste against caste, subcast against subcast. So everywhere you have a policeman and keep everybody else down. So we should not use it as an argument against how primary point is how do you put it under the of the caste system. Then one or two other points I want to mention here. In the latest JS history, not even one Sharia is there in the final <laughs> it is so that there is no danger of an history becoming a secretary and having pretensions to become a cabinet secretary which happened in 1996-97 and the man who uh, tried to do that was served with the charge sheet on the day of his retirement. Oh, it was crashed with the CAT, upheld by the High Court. See, so this, this, uh, this can, I'm sorry Mr. Krishna, this cannot be a subject matter of discussion here. After all, we are not uh, hearing the grievance. Uh, no, 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 my question is, no, my question is, yes. that if in relation to OBC, in Indra, Indra Sony second judgment, if, if the notions have said that three should be identified, and their premium data should be segregated. Why can't the same system be applied in the case of Shadunka Sinchez and It cannot be applied because Article 335 speaks of, yeah, yeah, Article 335 speaks of efficiency of administration. For every act, uh, every aspect of invalidating a special provision in favor of backward classes or Shadunka 335 is invoked. Why is the judiciary not considering this aspect of the matter? If you eliminate the best among the scheduled cars on the ground of premier layer, you are going you are getting only second class or third class of people from those sections. The idea is to get the best from the scheduled cars also because that is to promote efficiency of Article 335 is not idea of the Sorry, basic concept of reservation is to provide adequate representation. It has nothing else. That is the only object of reservation and therefore as long as it serves the purpose of providing adequate representation, there shall be no other way. Adequate representation at the cost of lowering the criteria. No, sir, no. No, yes, no, no, no. Constitution, you see, Constitution clearly. But in practice, it is lowering the criteria. No, don't lower the criteria. No, no, no. This question, this constitution clearly says, Indrasani has answered this question conclusively. Indrasani has answered this question. Vasant Kumar has answered this question that there is no lowering of merit. No lowering of efficiency. Lo lo lowering of merit in so far as super specialties in medical medical admission are concerned. But in so far as so far as recruitment uh, is concerned, it recognizes the lowering of merit. Yeah, I have one, uh, may I uh, say yes, with the permission please. of the chair? Yes, please. Uh, I have one uh, the, I mean, uh, suggestion that uh, on the one hand, uh, when you are uh, saying that to maintain the efficiency, uh, the second uh, stage uh, premier layer should not be excluded. And uh, Professor Verma uh, uh, Kumar said that the basic purpose of uh, the reservation is the adequate uh, representation. But uh, I suppose the basic purpose is the upliftment of that class and not uh, the adequate representation. And I may say if we go to the constitutional history, the purpose of enactment was the upliftment of that class. And second was that when the caste were to be identified, it was uh, suggested that how to identify a particular class 
which is uh, a downtrodden class and therefore caste was made as one of the basic measurement for the purpose of saying that by and large those who belong to a particular class they are in a downtrodden class and therefore that is how the schedule the word schedule caste was added and they and the caste which are included in the schedule they are known as schedule caste it is not on account of the social measure but it is on account of the upliftment of that class the purpose i mean it has been introduced therefore if they are already uplifted financially uh, it does require consideration that no further uh, benefit should go to that particular class Yeah, thank, thank you, you thank you brother yeah, 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 yeah. now we have to conclude the session yeah, yeah, yeah. Only, 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 we have to this, conclude the this, session this uh, time is up yeah now we have to move on to a uh, uh, next interesting session just for just one minute you can just quickly yeah, yes. i will yes. see yes. you have to draw a distinction between the poor of a general category and the shadow caste there is a distinction the poor from the high caste suffered from poverty and lack of access to resources and therefore marginalized yes sir. but the shadow caste this would have taken the shadow caste suffered not only from poverty and lack of access to resources but also discrimination and untouchability so untouchable required real solution and the poverty as well as my city the urban area hardly is in existence no 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 no, no, no. please 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 understand this distinction. If, if there is no discrimination being faced by untouchable, then you don't require a separate policy for the shadow class. Yes, sir. Common policy would work, but you have to recognize this distinction. Yes, sir. May I have the permission of the chair to answer some of the questions? Uh, yes. I think there is some there is some truth in what the other they say, and there is some mis misunderstanding of the uh, situation as well. First thing that there is no discrimination even for the who have come up also is not correct. Even in the Delhi, can a Dalit get a the accommodation in a big residential area when he discloses that he is Dalit? The answer is no. In the city itself, it is being practiced. Therefore, the discrimination has not gone. Second thing is educational basis. Yes, there are those who have got the advantage of the reservation. Their children are getting educated. There are in the rural area who are still lagging behind. Therefore, in the Constitution Review Commission, we had suggested that in every district, separate schools have to have the and the power of force. This class one the, the schools, the English medium schools, should be established to, to the Dalits, to the Adivasis, and to the weaker sections, including the upper classes. Thank you very much, sir. Just I a minute. Want to, I want just to just a minute. Sir. I have not finished that. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm taking, but it takes a long time. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm there. No, sir. <laughs> Therefore, if that principle is accepted and acted upon, in future there is no need for reservation. And they said, "Our children will compete on their own." Thirdly, you can come across where even the the federal caste officers they have given the responsibilities. There is no depth of efficiency at all. Efficiency is one term, mental block. Given the opportunity, they will come up. They will prove second to none. That is proved by several several people. Thirdly, yes, we should percolate from bottom to the higher most. Recently, political play is being played, subdividing these people on the caste basis, seeking for reservation on the basis of A, B, C, D, etc., which was started out by Andhra Pradesh Telugu government and being repeated in others. I have addressed a letter to the Prime Minister Sonia Gandhi and others, and there I have suggested, and this method I have suggested even as early as 1983, that. The reservation should percolate from bottom most. The children of the illiterate, the, the agriculture laborers, the, the, the daily wage workers, and the farm laborers, that their children should be given first priority in the reservation, in education, and also in service. If there is any left over, that should be given to the class three, class four employed children. And till others till the placement are there. It will be thrown open to the others. If that method is followed, then this problem of discrimination would be eliminated 
and every generation will get the opportunity. I asked them to constitute a commission to go scientific inquiry into it and then adopt the policy of percolating the reservation from bottom mosque to the top mosque. If that is followed up, then necessarily all these problems may not arise. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Uh, today, yes, yes, last one question. thing I want to uh, bring notice to the learned speakers yes. in West Bengal, uh, hardly discrimination exists on class basis. I think Mr. Thar, Justice Tanukar and yes. Justice Bhutto Shah. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, we will come back now. The uh, session ends here. Now, the uh, most interesting part is the next session. We move on for lunch. Yes, sir. So we we'll start. We'll have but this is not denial of right to food. Please do. <laughs> I've never had a chance to overrule a judge. So <laughs> Please, you are most welcome. Yeah. Yes. So we'll uh, have lunch at 1.30. We'll take half the remaining session now. Yes. Uh, Justice Nirmal Yadav has so kindly consented, sir, to be the chairperson. Please come, sir. Please. Thank you. Please, yes, Justice Yadav yes. will leave after lunch, so we'll, set, we'll have a session. And we'll do half of the session because of time constraints now and the remaining half after lunch. It's our most important session, uh, Lordships and friends. Our most important session because our dear, dear friends and victims of atrocities come. Our, uh, the victims of atrocities in the states of Odisha, Pakistan, Tamil Nadu, Andhra Pradesh and Bihar University. Yes. They are here today and they've traveled from a very long distance to be with us today. And uh, <coughs> we'll also ask my colleagues, please, Vincent and Paul, I'd like uh, all your lordships to see the co-organizers of this session. They are the President and General Secretary of the National Campaign for Dalit Human Rights. And they have done extraordinary work in the country, highlighting the plight of uh, the victims of atrocities. Rape cases, throwing excreta in the wells, robbing the animal, displacement from land. Um, which one? The cyclist girl, yes. So let's start with Orissa and then do Bihar. Please come. We have half an hour for the half, half the session and give the remaining half hour. So I think we are ready. Let me do Bihar quickly. Anyone? Yes, yes. Thank you. Thank you, Orissa. But we'll, we'll try and uh, stop the session by 130, 135. Before the victims come here, I ask the Paul Jawa to introduce all of them. I will suggest you want to complete this session, then. Uh, right, sir, we can do that as well, if it's okay with you. Paul, Paul, can you tell us few words about this campaign? Pain on the Lit Human Rights uh, is a campaign that has been initiated uh, around in 98. It's been launched by with the support of uh, the previous president, K.R. Narayanan Ji, with the whole campaign cast out cast. Primarily because for the last 30 years, 20 to 30 years, three decades or so, many of us have been working in the villages, not necessarily with a caste uh, focus, but primarily focusing on the poor and their marginalization. And slowly many of us have realized that the poor and the marginalization has been concentrated on this whole issue of caste-based discrimination. And even though this issue has been working and we are working in the villages, it has become extremely difficult for many of our activists even to register a single complaint. A charge sheet which normally should take only 30 days was taking more than six months. And most of the provisions of the acts that were there were not being actually cited in the, uh, in the definitely not in the FIR, but not, not also at the chat sheet. It is because of this experience that many activists, many of them are here, Mark Makwan, uh, Vimal Thoraji, 
and all the uh, leaders who have uh, been here to start and others that we felt that we need at the national level a, a platform to bring it to the visible level these kinds of marginalization and these kinds of specific victimization that is taking place which not only is affecting the community as such but is really a lack on the development of our country and that was the reason uh, for us initiating and uh, we are supporting the cause of the various uh, uh, communities and victims and these are our sisters and brothers who have been uh, brought primarily to share their uh, stories with you thank you friends the density hr has already capacitated more than 700 dalit youth both men and women to undertake fact finding whenever a cost of torture atrocity is reported in 14 states in india so far from january to september only on the reported cases more than 229 fact findings have been done by for for this judicial collective we have invited only we have brought here only five victims from the states of andhra pradesh tamil nadu bihar rajasthan and orissa and uh, somebody raised a question saying that we know about the situation we know about the law but you tell us where the law is not implemented where the sharp comments are this critic will speak about where the sharp comments are right from the police station to the judiciary and that so so they will talk first i will invite this girl from orissa the name is mamta nayak you would have already known this is a sensational case because it was telecasted by uh, indi tv now she will come and speak
पुलिस पीपल ऑफ कॉम्प्रोमाइज कॉम्प्रोमाइज क्या था अभी एसपी और कलेक्टर बोला नॉलेज लो के जाएगा गैंग को अंदर साइकिल रखा इससे बोला आप साइकिल से जाती सारे पहले जाते हैं सारे पहले जाते हैं कि साइकिल से सभी जाते हैं ना पक्की दलित लड़की नहीं है अभी ये गांव में सिर्फ एक ही लड़की और कोई भी लड़का भी नहीं है एक ही लड़की जो पहली बार मेट्रिक पास हो गया अभी और लेटर आंसर देखिए आप बताइए कि अभी और भी लड़कियां जो दलित या लड़की हैं जाते हैं साइकिल पर चढ़कर गांव में या नहीं जाते वो बताइए समझ आया आप बताइए नहीं क्या और भी लड़का लड़की ने कोशिश करी जाने की और नहीं जाने दिया हमारे साथ गांव की कोई लड़की नहीं जाना चाहता था और नहीं जाने दिया किसी और लड़की लड़की ने भी आपकी तरह जाने की कोशिश करी साइकिल पर किया अभी क्या गांव में डर है क्या जाने का ये बताइए ममता आप उड़िया में बताइए हिंदी अगर नहीं आ पा रही है आप उड़िया में बताइए बच्चे दलितों के बच्चे पढ़ते हैं किस कक्षा तक पढ़ते हैं नाइन्थ पढ़ते हैं साइकिल से जाते हैं वो नहीं नहीं बहन को अभी भी नहीं जाते साइकिल और जाएंगे साइकिल गड़े गड़े कर जाएंगे गांव के बाद पारी हो जाने के बाद जब से बैठ कर जाएंगे सिटिंग ऑफ द साइकिल दे कान सिट ऑफ द साइकिल उर्मिला देवी सीज प्रार्थना बिहार स्टेट सी वॉज गैंग राइट एंड दी फैक्ट्री हेल्प इन ऑलरेडी सर्कुलेट मेरा नाम है उर्मिला देवी हमको आ रही थी पति ले आके बोलती है गुना गा उसकी बगल में परवाना है सब पी रही थी पांच आदमी तार सब पी रही थी तो उसको धर लिया पति जी की धर लिया था हम भाग चले तो फिर घूर के आई तो हमको धर लिया हमको धर के पुरस्कार किया और सब छीन लिया गाना देवर सब हमको पति जी के मारने लगा पशी से ऐसा ही सहन को बलात्कार किया हमको साथ में सारी था सब साग था मसूरी था खेसारी था दाग था सब ले ली आती है घर पर चल जाती है हम लोग के मार रहे हैं डराती है हम साथी है 
lo que pueden usar de nadie. ये काम बोलती है बोना उसके बगल में है जा रहे थे इसके असम गाड़ी धर रहे थे हम लोग के धर लिया आप ये बताइए क्यों किया इस तरह से हाँ कमजोर नहीं है तो ना बरिया रखन तो ऐसे करता है घर के भी चाप जाता है हम लोग के मारने की she said be a weak if we were uh, strong do you think they will do like that what is the issue on which this happened was it मजदूरी के वजह से या जमीन के वजह से क्या समस्या थी जिससे वो लोग आपसे उठे Honorable Chairman, let us let us not impress our much. Our much is not impressive. I know that. I think that NHRC should take up the case if it is a case of gang rape. Then it should be registered under Section 3762. No G. No G. No G. But it is only simply sitting under 3766. That is all. I think this problem is not of NHRC or of the rape case. Her problem is that the person and her, she and her husband are being tormented, tormented and are compelled to leave their helme, hamlet and therefore she needs protection so that fearlessly she may go to the court. I got one more suggestion. Call the court, high court. Take super good note. Why wait for the NHRC with its limitations of staff all over the country? I think the courts also be so good. Mr. Krishna, this would be a bit embarrassing for...
They are just passing through that way and there is five minutes drinking toddy. They are so young couple walking and then they just come and beat him up, chase him away, pulls her into the nearby bushes and rapes her. This is an uh, easy thing that has happened with this case. Problem, law and order, then you, I think the authorities should take care of this and the organizations also take up this issue with the government authorities. It's like we are acting upon prosecuted commercial and we don't require any kind of So one is talking about the legality, what section is filed, whether charge is there or whether it's a subjudice or any charge should do that, all these are all fine. The points he makes here is he is not able to come back to a village again. That is the point here. For which you can, we can say that we can go to the police station. They will say you come back, we will say that. But what will happen, we all know. Her point is I am gang raped. It was very difficult to find my case. Even in judiciary it is getting delayed. I am not able to come back to my own village. That is the point that we have to find out. No, there is nothing of the kind. Nobody said that it is being delayed at the level of the judiciary. She no. never said so. She only says she is under the fear that she cannot return to the village because of the under the threat of the so, those people. Do you, do you expect to say that whether she will say that it is delayed and all that? Yeah, so how should we know about this? Yeah. A charge sheet to be filed within 30 days yeah. or 90 Mr. days? Mr. Vincent, no. filing of the no. charge sheet, you see, it, 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 it is not within no. our area. My point is, not the legality alone is matter, yes. there are other matters. Don't try to confuse the issue. There is no charge that when the court is informed, then there is a delay. There is a delay. Your version is reflecting upon the judicial and activism. And even the lady who is sitting, standing behind, narrating the story, we don't want the repetition. It's a shame to the entire society, entire country. There is a So the lady has told us, I, that's why I pointed out, her problem is that somehow she should be secured of her life and to go back to home and do the case back. Exactly. Please, that's what we are please, it was for you to go to the court and high court file a public a, a, just a mere application on a paper instead of yes. coming to Delhi that's that they are unable to go there. They are unable to go, go and they should be given security. That is, that's what I said. NHRC, somebody, some organization should go and approach the court. That they should be given uh, security. Every day the courts are providing security to such victims. Under section 226, the uh, courts are passing orders. Then you can always approach the courts for that. Yes, only one point I am raising with permission of the chair. By bringing her in this body, uh, see, as uh, Brother Mishra has rightly said, we have already been quite sensitized and we are aware of this problem. But our Arena begins when the case is brought before us. Here you will find the trial has not started. The charge, it just charge sheet has been filed. It's not before any court of law. So here the judiciary in any way cannot be blamed for any delay and she has not imputed that. Second thing is this, that by we are bringing her here, as rightly pointed out, uh, very rightly pointed out by the Honorable Chairperson, you could have taken recourse in the proper local forum instead of bringing her to Delhi. Does it, doesn't it embarrasses her? Yeah, Point for Please, me, appreciate here is not to get any justice from this forum, that I know that. That we are going there to the court and we are doing that. But no, no, the point here is she has to come there no, and depose. I, 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 I never made the point. Mr. Manohar, she is just as saying that. He is simply saying it is rather, you know, embarrassing. Embarrassing. Ah, it's rather, you know, this is the thing. She could have just discussed this issue otherwise. Exactly. Exactly. So not can we have the next question? Please, can you ask the question? I would just like to make a comment. Yes. Uh, I'm newly enrolled as an advocate. I hope that uh, you will not dismiss my comment as uh, coming from an inexperienced person. I hope you won't discriminate me, discriminate me on the basis of age. My name is Vikas. Uh, just a small comment. Because... Okay. All right.
So they searched for the boy and then on the following day they gave a complaint into the police station, Chenji police station that the boys, two boys are missing, their boys. But then the police asked them, you, you go and search. So after 10 days, the police traced out the boys and produced before the court and then it was sent their minor handed over to the parents. So then she also represented her problem to the collector and the higher authorities and later after few months the police came to her husband and got a signature saying that you, this is an information to come to the court. So later the chief got a uh, uh, notice from the court that the uh, case is closed and then they represented in the court and this, uh, the court said uh, this case is uh, closed if you want if you further uh, private uh, complaint. So 
So then the, the upper caste people told you can't do anything, you go, just go. And then uh, they also blocked the way to the paddy field. They are not able to go to the paddy field. Okay, this is because these people have got a piece of land and they don't depend on the Aikas people for their livelihood, so they have vengeance. Also, he has son uh, become a captain in the cricket team. So actually, you are not. The police got the signature asking that they don't want to continue with the case. So but they don't want to prosecute the case. Yes, proceed with the case. And then they uh, also the uh, uh, police uh, presenter submitted a referred charge sheet. So based on the referred charge sheet, the court uh, uh, gave the uh, FM, uh, 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 and closed the case. But then they submitted an uh, 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 objection in writing. But the honorable <coughs> magistrate said, they, no, 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 you, we want if you uh, file fresh petition. So, player complaint. File a division. In the high court, you can ask her to say, 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 and then the same investigating officer will be asked to do the same. Even if, my lord, if you go to the high court, ask for a revision, and the revision will ask for the further investigation. Who will investigate the case? They will change the officer. They will change the officer. They will change the officer. Can we leave the investigation? But the case is not changed. I am an advocate and practicing for the 13 years. I know the struggle as a different of Dalit. The mindset, as your Honor has said very well, the mindset of the investigating officer is not to understand the problem of the Dalits. So, you have section 36 of the... You can't condemn everyone. I mean, we can't say that everybody is uh, corrupt or everybody is under somebody's influence. If you go, I mean, as you rightly pointed out, Justice Rao, sorry, that you can always uh, approach the high court and the investigation will be on for that. And we call it quite important. Leave of the chairperson. Sir, one minute, sir. Leave of the chairperson. Uh, you said that the mindset of the investigating agency is same person. Section 36 of the CFP, you are a practicing lawyer, you are yeah. more aware. You, you can uh, pray for a for investigation by a higher officer. Higher officer. Uh, that you can, now it is settled law when there is a uh, final report. Either you find a Naraji petition or the magistrate, with, uh, the, you know, see, the court cannot go beyond the CFP. As an activist, I take your wife's advice, my lord, but kindly understand that the struggles we are going through. That's all I want to say. No, so I think it's the honor. That's very right. But what is there in the law, we have to interpret it. We cannot go beyond that. Now, yes, yes. Can I, I think uh, you go, uh, I, I think we, uh, the lunch is also waiting for us. Oh, yes. So if uh, we can oh, yes. have the other side. We are waiting for the lunch. <laughs> the lunch is waiting for us. So can we have the next person? Yeah. from Rajasthan. Yeah, yeah. So she will come in. We are all voting about the sections and the procedure of the spine. We also know that we are also practicing advocates. The point here is to make 
Okay. You know, if you say like that, you will say we know the situation. No, no, that's right, of course. Anyway, now I am calling the, from the Rajasthan. Uh, the victim called Sakti Devi. The Rajasthan has been killed because he has uh, filed a nomination to contest the election, much against the will of the local election. हरम भरियो तो मेरो दलेब सिंह टीकम सिंह शिवदान सिंह मेरो हरम कटा दियो तो मेरे छोटा वाला बच्चा है तो बिने स्कूल मु हेजो को बाप मेरे कागज आगे सब उतर भरा कर पूरा हेन फार्म खर्च करा गया मेरा टावरा छोटा वाला बच्चा तो फार्म खर्च करा गया जन एक तारीख को मंगलवार को मैं घड़ी लुगई पाली रवाने गया कागज ले 8 बजे बेस करण वास्ते जणे मैं महादेव जी छई कड़ी बात हो जणा घड़ी लुगई में ज्यादा हा तो वे आगे आगे चलता वे लारे लार जाती तो आखिर बीच में मैं बस पहुंची तो शिवदान सिंह गणेश सिंह टीकम सिंह टैक्टर लेने आया मेरे घर में राडो फेरियो मेरे पति ने मेरे पति राडो फेरता ही गणेश सिंह नीचा उतरे जो को चकू लग लगो होगा जो चकू मार जब भी टेम हमारे घर लगन लगा हमार पति जणे शिवदान राम भगवान राम सुतरा राम सुतरा राम भगवत राम भगवान राम मर घर आ रहे आड़ा खिला टीकम सिंह सिद्धार्थ सिंह ऊपर टेंट पर वो नीचा उतर पकड़ ली था जब मैं बीच में पड़ी गया भाई मर पति ने मारे मारे तो मेरे को धको दे दिया तो माना हाथ में दलेब सिंह जब और माने डुबा दे भाई मन धको दे दिया मैं बीच में पड़ी जाने जब मैं हाथ में जब वो छूट गया तो वो जब वो छूट गया मेरा घर जमीन पर उंधा भर का गायब होगा तो वो जब वो जब वो आप वो शिदान सिंह घुटा है शिदान सिंह घुटा फिर मेरे घर है मोरा पर जब वो मार गया तो फादर शिदान सिंह बोल रहे हैं कि टीकम सिंह तू वो वो देखे कहीं हेड कमिल बाउंस अपना दुश्मन है नहीं कुछ तो तो फिर टेम्परा फिर वो जाने एक तो पर चढ़ गा एक तो पर चढ़ कर आज शिवदान सिंह को बैठो टीकम सिंह तो वो राउंड काट गया राउंड काट गया बाज में कोई मेरे घर में सुधरो नहीं आया तो शिवदान सिंह बोल रहे अगर मान लो कोई सुधरो ना आएगा तो इन दरिगा हूँ धारी मारूंगा जब कोई नहीं आया कैसे ना कोई जी मिनर हाऊलांग जी धारारांग ओम पर का सा तो क्या हाका जरूर करिया पर सुधरो ना आज तो नहीं आया जाने एक दिन वार गर्दन ये घटना करी दिन फैल के दिन पंचे जने आज ना ये स्थिति में तो जाए एक फोन करियो तो थाना में जता रहे तो कोई कारवा नहीं करी कोई सुरक्षा नहीं करी तो सुबह का तो धनी लोगे रवाने रिया है यानी आधा दिन आ घटना करी है अबे और बार दिन बार ओकर मैं धनी रो तो पूर्ण दिन है जो को जेड तो पुलिस ही तो बार दिन बार ओकर ये बिल बाज में वन परिवार आए वो वन धमकियां दी है मैं घर पर बंदूक का छोटी है कि थारों को मार लगा तो अबे है तो माँ एक अठे इन जेतारन अंदर के माँ या जेतारन कोर्ट में महीने माँ आज पर धन्ना लगाया ढाई मीना ढाई मीना धनों लगाया बाज में मैं घर के यार तो मेरा छोटा बाल बच्चा है तो बीच में आड़ गिर गया और भी बड़ा आड़ गिर गया तो हमें बाहर बाहर है जो मन में दबके देना है तो घर पर बंदूक का चलाता है कि है जो को मैं मार दूंगा तो ये को बयान कर दो तो राजी को कर दो तो मैं भी राजी को करने नहीं चाहूँ तो अब के आप के हाथ जोड़ के ना है तो मर गई कि कोई शायद करना है मेरे को न्याय we need not to dwell upon the issues at the moment. Yeah, 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 yeah,
See how is it that the problem here? This is an election dispute between two parties. But she says it's not the work. The lady who was raped. She would, that that's a human problem. I don't think it's a Dalit problem at all. It's just like any other rape. How is it a special Dalit problem? No, actually, she says that because she is a Dalit, she dared to contest election. That's why she. That's what. Uh, Her husband was a was the previous MLA. No, 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 no. 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 No, no, no bring before the judges the caste dimension of it. Yes. And if those dimensions are not appreciated, then, then, then you know, I am a little worried. No, that's true of the view. Uh, the, uh, yeah, view so in response, in response to the Honorable Judge, that here is a Dalit uh, person who wants to contest the election, he showed the courage to contest the election, he is scared. Here is a Dalit woman who is susceptible to rape. Like not any other woman, but Dalit women are more susceptible to rape. This is the background that I think judges should appreciate. And they actually judges are appreciating that's an opinion given by one of the honorable judges. Because, because the Dalit has been murdered, it's not a Dalit issue. It is a Dalit. That is the problem. It is a. It is a. Yes. Give me the cases. We are. Give me the cases. The incidence of cases. Proportion of cases where the high caste. Yeah, uh, panchayat are killed because they contest the election. So Tamil Nadu, Tamil Nadu, Mr. Farhan, Tamil Nadu, 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 Tamil Nadu,
जस्टिस मैं आपको बता दू की इस केस में ये तीन एक्यूज थे जो भी इसमें मैंशन है लेकिन वो विद इन सेवन डेज में इंट्रीम बेल मिल गई है किसी के साथ दो हजार में इलेक्शन लड़ा तब तो नॉमिनेशन खारिज नहीं हुआ उसके बाद जो लोकल सामंत है सो कॉल्ड एम एल ए उसने इंटायर रिकॉर्ड चेंज करवा दिया स्कूल में इसके जो बच्चे हैं उसकी जन्मदिन चेंज करवा दी सो ठीक है आप ठीक कह रहे हैं तो ये अथॉरिटी में होने की वजह से ऑनरेबल चेयरमैन आई जस्ट सबमिट वन थिंग यू काइंड परमिशन Honorable Justice Kerr has been totally misunderstood in the context in which he stated. We are not judging these cases over here. Oh, Firstly, yes, they should yes, understand. Yes, yes, All yes. Prof Professor Thorat should understand. We are not judging the issues over here, the facts of the case over here. We have been enough sensitized. We quite appreciate your all gestures. We yes. appreciate. We needed this type of sensitization. At the same time, Justice Kerr query cannot be wiped off totally. Because by raising a case, every judge is required to look into this aspect whether this offence was committed to this gentleman by virtue of the caste or not, or by virtue of woman. Whether she whether she, she, she was, suffered that offence. That was he meant. Yeah, 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 that is a. The rape was committed. Even the other caste woman also. Supposed to inform, look into in every case. We have to see. We are not giving a verdict over here. We are just pondering over an issue. <laughs> एक्चुअली वॉट जस्टिस है मैन दैट रेप वर कमिटेड इवन अदर ऑन अदर वीमेन अदर गर्ल्स अदर चिल्ड्रन ऑल्सो तो वोट लड़िया से वोट लड़िया तो फिर देखा फरान को हमारे बच्चा को जन्म कप्तान सिंह बोल रहे हैं कि आज कल ही कभी फिर गाँव में ने मेरे खिलाफ कोई चुनाव नहीं लड़िया तो ये चुनाव कैसे लड़िया था वो आपके चुनाव लड़ियो बैंक के चुनाव लड़ी मैंने डेढ़ सौ वोटों में हार गई आपके चुनाव लड़ रहा था भरम भरी तो मैं भरम खर्च करा दी तो भरम खर्च करा दी तो अभी मैंने मेरा को पति को खत्म कर दिया The next and the last case is from Andhra Pradesh. This is the last. Uh, yeah, last one. <laughs> and this address it is according to the victim was because of the land struggle and they have taken care, taken possession of 2000 acres of land. Yeah. 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 And uh, the offshoot of this, several cases were filed uh, against. Never had that point. Yeah, absolutely. Under interrogation. हमारे आंध्र प्रदेश सूचना जिला उदयपल्ली मंडल पंडमेल मंडल दलित बाधपड़ता है चाल मंदिर अच्छा बाधल असल अट्रासीटी के पेटना पोल पट्टुकने पैस्थित अब रेल ईद रूपये अच्छी यादव शिरोमणि